Life is too short to film crap. You take these people on a journey, you let them think this is the way it is, and then you flip it. And you really, you, you leave them nowhere left to go. And, and I really love that idea of storytelling. Those are the sort of films that inspire people to make them. What I wanted to say to people that wanted to make films, if you've got the persuasive skills, you can get all these people together, you can make a film. I sprung a surprise on a member of our production team. I made him lie downstairs in a pool of blood, something he wasn't expected. I did say I'd get him a little bit more involved than he currently was, and he felt that in order to repay me, he needed to give me a big hug. So I'm from the retail background. I know what I know and I know what I need to know and I learn what is interesting to me and everything else is irrelevant. We didn't really do the whole school thing. I used to go to school, register and go home, go, go back in the afternoon, register and go home or go and okay. play in the quarries or do whatever it was. Uh, I didn't really do education. Death Walks, one person described it as the darkest film that had been made in British history and that we weren't ready for it. Like all the major yeah. horror websites are now talking about us. Yeah. I'm proving I can get people together for lit next to nothing. I'm proving I can secure a location. All these different things. It's not as straightforward as me just setting up a crew and saying we're going to set up a film, we're going to make it, blah, blah, blah. And, and here we are. We're making this film. And we've had four night shoots. We've had two all-nighters and one two short night. I've got all these people across from some of them from all over the country, some from out of the country. We, we started shooting at about 8 o'clock on the 15th and we carried on shooting through into the 16th. We had to finish at 6am. The end result of this is just to show that you can do this sort of thing and you can get people that do it professionally and people that are in it for the sort of passion of it. It is, as well as being a short film, it is kind of a really sort of a community project. It's a zero, zero, zero budget. There's no budget. No budget at all. So anybody, anybody that has come to that, we, I've not gone out and asked for anything other than people's time and their experience. And some people have already felt the result being attached to this film. But there's this bit right at the end and it's like, oh my god, I can't believe this has happened. And I love that idea of storytelling, is you take these people on a journey and you let them think you know where this story's going and then you do something completely different. And that was the script for Death Walks. I think people, I think people will see this on the fact that it was the zero budget film that was made in Romford. When I go and make my next film, this is something I will take with me. I was almost writing a script before I realised that I was writing a script, if that makes sense.